Good morning, guys. It is 10.30 in the morning. I'm waiting for my train to take me back to Bristol. Spend the night in Wales. I spent some time in Wales. Wales has been fun, but like I said, I have to go back to Bristol and I have to head out that way because unfortunately, I screwed up when I booked my crane train tickets. I wanted to spend another day here, but um, unfortunately I didn't book things correctly and I screwed up and I, I'm mad at myself for that because I wanted to spend more time in Wales because I do love Wales and I, I love my family and I felt like I didn't have enough time out here and I'm really upset about that, but whatever. It is what it is. I can't change it without paying an enormous amount of money to change it, so I have to live with it. I can always come back and stay for longer. I definitely think I would rent a car so I would have just a little bit more freedom. The transportation out here is fantastic, but nothing beats a car, so... <coughs> I just choked on my own saliva. Yeah, I am the only one in this entire train station. Just thought I would mention that. I am literally the only person out here. There's no fare collector in this station. There's literally a set of stairs over there, and that's it. You literally walk up to the station, you got two platforms. So you can't get lost. You can't get lost. It's literally impossible to get lost here. Um, unlike Bristol, where there's like 17 different platforms, there's only two here. Standing around waiting for the train to get into the station, and then we'll be en route back to Bristol, and then tomorrow we are en route to London! I'm very, 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 very excited. Um, like I said, I love Wales. I 10 out of 10 recommend coming here. It's a beautiful, beautiful, lush place to come. If you want some, I guess, some peace and quiet from the big cities, Wales is definitely the place to come because it's got more nature and it's just, the people are a little bit more friendly and it's just, you, you get more culture when you come to Wales, for sure, definitely. So I would recommend coming out here. If you're looking for more peace and quiet and you're looking for, I guess, more nature, because it's 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 full of that. It's, it's very lush and green and nice. So I recommend it, but um, yeah, wish I was here for longer, but unfortunately not. So I'll keep you guys posted when my train comes. It should be here soon. We're in Newport right now. It's about another 10 minute wait before our train comes. So hopefully it'll be here on time. Our train is here. On time. Oh, such a relief to be on time. had to leave um, my grandmother's house and my aunt's house because they were so happy to see me but like so sad that I was leaving so I was sad to say goodbye but I didn't really have a choice because I screwed up my booking so I had to leave um, but yeah I'm just heading back to my Airbnb now I'm gonna pick up my luggage gonna go around do some uh, shopping I guess and some tours and we'll just continue on from there and then Tuesday tomorrow we head out to London so I'm super super excited yeah, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Wait, it's across the street. They're doing a ton of construction around here. They're doing tons of construction around here. So there's just pylons everywhere. It was also so funny because I was trying to find the I was trying to find the elevator, but like I asked the guy and he didn't know what I meant. Because <laughs> I kept I kept saying, where's the elevator? And he's like, what? I'm like, the elevator. He's like, oh, 
oh, you mean the lift? I was like, oh, yeah, I'm in England, I remember. They call that the lift, not the elevator. So my Canadian slang is not coming in handy, guys. It's not coming in handy at all. And it did rain yesterday, which was kind of sucky, but it only rained last night. It didn't rain during the day, so I'm just hoping the clouds hold up for just a little bit longer and it doesn't pour down because I'd be really upset if it did, so hopefully it holds us. I finished up at the post office. I sent some things off to my grandmother and aunt, so they have stuff for me, or well, from me, and then sent those off. I'm going back to my Airbnb now because I am tired, and I got a long day out to London tomorrow. It's gonna take me about three hours to get out there, so I'm ending this video, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, you know what to do, and I will see you in my next video.